Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for joining me. So today I want to do a tribute to Harry Lorraine. Mexi Max, who is uh, just, I think, the world of this person. He has really supported and encouraged me. And, and uh, you know, he just, he's a champion in our art. And Mexi, if you're watching, I appreciate you very much. So I did a video a while back called Go Before You Are Ready. Go Before You Are Ready. And the day that I released that video was the day that Harry Lorraine passed away. And Maxie, Max, uh, in the comments below that video, said this. Not quite the same meaning, but I will just mention Harry Lorraine going before he was ready. Perhaps a video about his life is in order. Maxi, I, I, you know, you might have been waiting for this. I know it's been a while. <clears throat> I, um, I know it's been a long time in coming. I've been mulling over some things, and you know, I, I don't think I'm going to do Harry Lorraine's life justice. I mean, you know, it, I remember when Scott Alexander passed away. I learned about his passing from Maxi, even though. Scott's local to me, and and we grew up together at the at the at the Denny and Lee's, and you know e even though uh, there was that relationship, I learned about I, I learned about these things from Mexi, and uh, I had no idea that that uh, Harry Lorraine had passed. Now, Harry was born May fourth, nineteen twenty six, and he passed on April seventh. So as I record this, we are in June. So it's been a, it's been a couple of months, uh, Mexi, and I apologize for the lateness. But again, I've been thinking about a few things, doing a few things. Uh, Harry Lorraine was a memory training specialist. He was an author and a magician. Mostly, he was a card magician, but he did other types of magic as well. Uh, Time Magazine called him the Yoda of memory training. Uh, his his uh, memory systems are used in corporate training to this day, and we'll talk about that in just a moment. The memory book was on the New York Times bestsellers list. He has authored, Harry Lorraine has authored over 46 books, 40, very prolific. He wrote a column in Apocalypse Magazine from 1978 to 1997, that's roughly 20 years. 20 years doing a column. Uh, and he also did a column in Genie Magazine as well. Uh, Lorraine saw his first card trick when he was six years old, or maybe seven. He collected two cents deposit on empty milk bottles so he could go out and buy a deck of cards. That's how poor his family was. He was not and probably one of the most brilliant people of his time. At age 18, he began to perform as a table magician at Billy Reed's Little Club in New York. Lorraine began appearing on national television in 1958. He has appeared on I've Got a Secret, The Ed Sullivan, the Ed Sullivan Show, Jack Parr, The Merv Griffin Show, The Mike Douglas Show, The Regis Philbin Show, Good Morning America, The Today Show, That's Incredible, David Suskind, he was a regular performer on The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson. In fact, he performed, he appeared on The Tonight Show over 24 times. One time in particular, uh, Johnny and Harry do sort of a retrospect. They look back on the number of times that Harry was on as a guest, and I'm gonna put that link down below. I would encourage you to take a look. He continued to lecture and actively write into his 90s. So again, fantastic contributor to the magical arts, Harry Lorraine. This is his number one bestseller, The Memory Book. Uh, you know, Harry used to do effects with his memory. I mean, magical things that, that people could not understand how he did. And he did have a, a tremendous memory. Uh, and, and, and this book is filled with tips and ideas on how you can strengthen and develop your own memory. Wonderful book. This is one of his more uh, prolific magic books, The Magic Book by Harry Lorraine. Highly recommended. Uh, just to look through it here, these books are illustrated. They're just wonderful. By the way, a little, little story, a little anecdote. Denny used to, used to encourage people to buy this book. 
and uh, he, he took an effect out of the book and he demonstrated it and he packaged it up along with the the photocopied notes from the book and he would he would offer it for sale at the price of the book and when someone would try to buy it he would say don't buy the effect for the price of the book buy the book and they would say but i only want that effect and they would insist on buy even though he did that not to sell the effect but to but to but to tell people you're getting a better value in books they still insisted on buying the effect so uh you know that that by the way that anecdote that story is in the biography of denny haney written by scott alexander uh, so those are two books by uh by harry lorraine the um this is the May 2023 20, issue of the Linking Ring, and there is a there is a tribute to Harry Lorraine in memory of Harry Lorraine in the May 2023 issue of the Linking Ring. Highly recommend that to you. This is this is the May 2023 issue of MUM Magic Unity Might, which is the publication of the Society of American Magicians. On, on uh, inside of this magazine, there is also a tribute to Harry Lorraine. This is Genie Magazine. This is the June issue of 2023. The June issue 2023 of Genie Magazine. They have a tribute to Harry Lorraine as well. So pick up one or all of these magazines, take a look, read the tributes to Harry Lorraine. Uh, he was a tremendous contributor to our art, a gentleman and a scholar, as they say. Uh, Maxi, thank you so much for calling my attention to it and for requesting it. I apologize for the lateness of the post, uh, but I appreciate your recommendation. Uh, thank you so much for joining me. Please comment down below. I love your comments. Please subscribe if you've not done so already. Have a great day and I will see you next time.